what is the evidence shown in what makes deals fail? What do the articles say? You didn't have a strategy, and uh, you overpaid, and you didn't manage the cultures right. So that's, that's what everyone will tell you. But it really is the nuance. It's making the difficult choices early on about what's the most important assets, portfolio of assets for your business that could be uh, accomplished through M&A. And that, that really is defining what's the role of M&A in your growth. Is it 10% of your growth, 20%, 30%? That's a pretty important question to know before you start making the biggest capital investment decisions. The other thing uh, I would say is that are you testing? If you think of what do you come out of m and strategy with? Propositions. Well, those propositions have to be tested. Now, you can either test them before a deal goes live, or you can make that as part of your ongoing diligence in the, in the market. And then, you know, diligence is not just about a go or no-go decision. It's about inputs to the valuation model, and building your early integration roadmap. So that you know, when you get to the board, the board's prepared to, to exercise their duty of care, you know, what an ordinary prudent person would do in similar circumstances, and you deliver a successful announcement day, and then you're ready to kick off sign to close planning immediately after announcement.